Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, dear viewers, uh, I don't have words that how much I'm happy today that I'm really honored that uh, a sister in Islam, dear respected honorable sister, Ninda Sources is with me. She's a voice for, the, for all Muslim sisters all around the world, especially in the United States. She's a strong voice against Islamophobia, xenophobia, Muslim ban. Welcome to Global TV, dear sister. Thank and uh, to, to you. so thank you here, Sam here. Please tell us about yourself. You are a paradigm symbol, a, a challenging woman. Tell us about yourself and about uh, your views about sister in Islam. And uh, you said the women march. Uh, uh, now you are uh, with the women march. Please. Um, Salam alaikum. I'm very honored to be here today. I am an organizer, a very proud Muslim American woman. I'm Palestinian American and I'm using my voice to defend the communities that I love, the Muslim American communities I'm a part of. Right now, um, we're fighting against the Muslim ban, which, as you know, is in the Supreme Court right now, fighting against all the immigration policies coming out of this administration. So I'm traveling around the country organizing Muslim communities, black communities, Latino communities, all kinds of communities to come together to fight against this administration. And alhamdulillah, I'm very proud of our community. Many Muslim Americans are running for office all over the country, for Congress, for governor, for state senate seats. I'm helping campaigns around the country. Inshallah, we will have many new Muslims who will be taking office this year. So sister, when you say a lot uh, in your speeches and uh, there, are, there is a reaction, what do you think? Like, uh, I personally read a lot about you that mm -hmm you have a lot of reaction so what do you think when you have reaction like even from uh, big bigs like from the administration mm -hmm. from the uh, high official every time i get any ne negative reactions or attacks i'm very proud i'm very proud that um, people are starting to hear the voices of muslim americans i am very proud to be that voice i am not afraid i only fear allah and um, i have continued to take all the attacks uh, because i believed very wholeheartedly in what I'm doing. I believe in justice. I believe in speaking truth. I believe in preaching Islam because Islam is my religion and I should be able to preach and talk about the sayings of the beloved prophet and use words like jihad and sharia without feeling afraid because that is my deen. And so I'm hoping that more young Muslim Americans see my example and continue to be proud of who they are. We're not going to let anybody take that away from us. Not the Islamophobes, not the right-wing Zionists, not the people who are against us or white supremacists. We should be proud of who, you are, who we are, and I'm very proud every day. Dear sister, do you have any message for the Islamic sister, uh, especially those who are living in the USA? I tell my Muslim sisters, be proud of who you are. Wear your hijab proudly. Use your voice. Allah gave you a voice to use for justice and for truth. And let us set an example for all the younger sisters in, the, in our country who are looking up to us in this moment. Thank you very much, dear sister. I appreciate you. Assalamu alaikum.